Hi guys, it's 9.38 on a Sunday morning. I'm over here just walking Max. These flats are almost finished, aren't they? Let's go. So, so um, could have been a lot worse. Upstairs has been pretty bad over the past week on and off. Um, I was talking about mental health problems, and I mean mental health doesn't it isn't the chronic illnesses depression, anxiety, bipolar, um, you know, things things make people worse, right, they do, they it make, it make a mental health illness worse, right, just things that make things worse, exacerbate things. So I'm not angry, I'm not cross, but can you understand? I'm trying to show people why why people get cross, why people get angry, lack of sleep, sleep deprivation, you know. Bullying is 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 another cause of mental distress, isn't it? Bullying bullying and harassing someone to the point where they don't uh, they don't want to well carry on so right you have to nip it in the bud right you have to nip it in the bud so if you stay silent, people will keep doing it until the point where you're going to explode. So you have to do something about it to stop it. I don't know who these people are. I don't know why they're doing it, but it's silly. Just keeping on and on and on at somebody until they, they cave in. Or whatever it is. Believe you me, if I was ugly and horrible, they would just leave me alone. It's just constant harassment. Day after day after day after day. Just constant. Um, I dealt with the online bully yesterday. I went, bye blocked them and shut them up <laughs> they thought they was going to start that again and I put a stop to that <laughs> um, so his kids have been constantly making noise on and off all week right and partly the weather's to blame because people are opening their balcony doors and opening their windows because the weather is hot for october it's hot so understandably so but this is deliberate this isn't just it's deliberate I will not be controlled by a bunch of thugs. I won't be controlled by a bunch of thugs, whether it's youths or adults. I am not being controlled by thugs. Intimidating me. I don't know whether it's fraud they're involved in. I'm trying to, I'm trying to. I can't. I mean, it's all right for them to make a whole crap load of noise, right? 
as soon as they don't like it, I have this I can't sit in my flat with no TV on nothing on on in there <laughs> and listen to their shit <laughs> so I put my telly up loud I put my music on I dance As soon as you start to, like I said, I'm going to get some clothes, I'm going to brighten myself up, you know, it starts again. You know, someone walking up that way, so I'm just walking over here. they've gone out the way I let Max off the lead and he could go down there it's a helicopter helicopter black one police police helicopter police helicopter flying overhead Yesterday the noise was so bad it was hurting my face and jaw, it was thumping, stomping. <sighs> what did I do? I just sat there and I put my tablet on and I put the radio on and eventually they, they burnt themselves out. There's the castle over there in the cathedral. And there's the train going across the station. You find out in this life that no one is going to help you. You've got to help yourself. You've got to help yourself in this world. No one else will help you whatsoever. They will find out your weaknesses and they will use them against you. They will. But there's something inside so strong. I know that I can make it. Though you're doing me wrong, so wrong. You know what I mean? Don't do drugs, don't smoke, don't drink. I can't even listen to music outside. So when these pillocks kick off on me, I fucking have to just take it. <laughs> they are pillocks. Bullies are pillocks. Sexual irritants. Sex pests. Why can't they just enjoy their own sex life and stop worrying about mine? <laughs> I was shocked by Liam Payne's death, absolutely shocked. He had everything, he had a beautiful girlfriend, everything that you could possibly want. And his life was cut short at the age of 31. Do you, everybody. Don't let everybody else do you. Do you. A bully is there for a few seconds and they're gone. They're nothing. They're nobody. It's not funny, 
You know, people commit suicide because they get depressed. Just some people are so just evil, aren't they? You know they know me because some, someone said to me they don't know you. I said they do because they know what they're doing. some kind of alarm I'm supposed to be this this I'm a woman right a female going through the menopause I've got disabilities I find it hard sometimes to actually walk and I do believe it or not I've got nerve damage and I'm having real jip in my fucking left ankle right now and when these pillocks let their dogs jump all over you and they do <laughs> Some of them, not all of them. I mean, that Charlie, right? I mean, I don't agree with what he did to me. Don't get me wrong. But this one guy let his dog jump all over Charlie's back until he nearly fell over and he didn't apologise, he didn't come over and get his dog off and say sorry <laughs> so dog walking is a risky business it is, it's a, it's a risky business and my dog is a tiny chihuahua you see I did see one woman's dog it was a, a while ago now. It was a little dog and it had been attacked on the field by a bigger dog and it was bleeding. <coughs> so I keep myself to myself, guys. I think it's the right thing to do. There's too much jealousy in this world. People get jealous and they want to be you, but they want to, they want, they, they put you down and tell you you're a load of crap, but they copy what you do, which doesn't make any bloody sense at all, does it? Don't make sense to me. So I, I hold my head up high and I carry on. And I ignore their stupid attempts at trying to get my attention, which is unwanted. <laughs> Coughing. Actually being quite evil and nasty to draw attention to themselves, because any attention to a bully is attention, whether it's being evil or cruel or whatever. <laughs> they just crave attention. They want your attention. And when you don't give it to them, they get worse. What happened last night was I took no notice of it at all and they, they've uh, wore themselves out and went to bed. Because, you know, the clocks went back last night. They went, they went to bed about 11, but it was really 10. So at least I had an hour's peace and quiet before they actually must have just dropped off to bed running around all day like that. Probably knackered themselves out. It's a nice boat, isn't it? And we've got the cathedral bells ringing this morning. Lovely. They have tried everything, everything to try and um, silence me, keep me quiet, shut me up. Come on. Um, I 
don't know what I'm going to do next, but I'm thinking of doing an online blog about mental health and how every day, what, what causes people to uh, come undone. Even when you've got absolutely everything. From the papers that we read when we get up in the morning, which is, is depressing, very depressing. Oh, I don't want to miss this. It's the goods train. If I can catch it. Look at that goods train going over there. I can't see it very well, it's a good train. See, I don't want to hurry home, I've got all that nonsense. Let's see if it comes out at the other end there. I can honestly say that at the moment it feels like my bottom of my foot is, is being stabbed. I've got nerve damage all over my body. Um, so I am walking on a foot that feels like it's got a knife stuck in it. And my ankle, that, that problem with the ankles come back because I had an injury on this field. I fell down one of these holes and twisted my leg the other way. <laughs> this field is full of holes like mole holes or badger holes. And my foot got stuck in it and it twisted to the left. And I fucked my ankle. And it's quite weak. But I'm happy enough, I'm smiling. I'm Got my camera out. It's usually when a neighbour upstairs is causing the underneath neighbour distress, it's usually the underneath neighbour that moves out. The neighbour underneath. So it's not it's not just me guys. It, 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 what I'm saying is it ain't just me. It's always the underneath neighbour that moves out, moves away. <laughs> used to drive my father crazy, noise did. He used to go mental. He used to go absolutely batshit crazy and start jumping out the window and going mental. Put up with it for four years now. Um, I'm bidding on properties every week, but nothing's happened yet. Uh, I've been in touch with the councillor, they haven't responded. Um, it's obviously someone stalking my YouTube channel as well, and that won't do them any good. Well, it won't. Just fell down a hole then, nearly. This guy's fishing over there. It's a good place to fish. So I'm not angry.
another train coming right guys i'm gonna go now i hope everybody has a great sunday and i'll see you later